Alright, welcome back guys. I'm sure you have at least heard about this. This is the first time I've actually found any length of footage over the the kid getting maced at a Seattle protest. I thought it was a girl. Your, your little kid looks like a fucking girl, even though it's a boy. I don't know what the fuck you were thinking. Bringing this child out to a protest when the protest had been consistently turning violent and had people in the quote-unquote peaceful protest acting violence out, and then for some reason you're shocked that you bring your child out there who's fucking seven, and then the kid gets maced because they're retaliating against the crowd, and you feel that for some reason the cops are in the wrong? Are you a fucking shit parent? Yes. Yes, the answer is very much so, yes. Looks like a girl. So, you've decided to bring your child to a protest in Seattle that you drove out of state to go attend. Right? So you decided actively decided not oh we're just gonna go and see this as it's happening in our town you left from where you lived and brought your entire family with you which uh, for some reason you thought was a good decision at what point in time does a seven-year-old need to see a protest I mean, does this parent not pay attention to the news? Like, really, do you not pay attention to the news at all? Look. Let's see if we can find something from years ago. Uh, let's do 2018. Okay, so... This has been going on for years in Seattle, okay? You guys want... No. See, look. This has been happening for years and years and years in Seattle. And you, for some reason, decided to take your seven-year-old child out of, out of at least your city to go and protest. That, that you're, you're a dumbass. And your child getting maced is your own fucking fault, not the police. Be a better parent. We'll see you guys in the next one.